Welcome to my Gamescom vlog. My name is Mix and I work as a professional esport caster and host. And this time I was invited to Gamescom to work for AMD and Yamaha. I'm going to take you with me to Cologne so you can get a behind the scenes and check out how Gamescom was like this year. All right. I just arrived in my hotel room and I am so exhausted. I only slept like three nights. Today is my first day of Gamescom and it started with a very early travel and all of my trains got canceled. And so I had to drive to a whole nother city, like 40 minutes away. And uh, I had to go there, take a new train. It took much longer, but I am in my hotel. So now I am going to freshen up, I'm going to get a coffee, I'm going to get some breakfast because I haven't really eaten yet, um, and then I'm going to go to Gamescom and I'll take you with me. Day number one, here we go! I don't think you have any idea how fast I really am. I'm fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> I personally was really excited that Sega was there and that they asked me to stream their new game, Endless Dungeon. So that was a whole experience that I had for the very first time streaming live from Gamescom. And it was super pleasant. So thank you so much to them for having me. And of course, you know, I had to give in to the weep challenge and go to hall six after all the signs they had been sending me. And then the first thing I see is this Naruto and it absolutely sent me. But check out what else they have here. <laughs> Not only did Netflix show off lots and lots of their shows, they also did live tattoos and they weren't the only booth that did at Gamescom. Now, I would never get tattooed at an event like this without any planning beforehand, but let me know what you would do, write it under the video. I'm very curious if there's something people would do because it's free.
In the evening, I went to the Asus RG event that was happening off Gamescom and that was invite only. I worked here last year, this time it didn't work out, but I was still very happy to see lots of friendly faces again. Good morning. I don't know if you can hear this, but I maybe yelled a little bit too much at the party that I went to, so my voice is, uh, <clears throat> it's a bit there, which is not the greatest start for a weekend of yelling, so I'm gonna try and fix that. But since I can't eat honey, I'll have to rely on these. Um, I'm going to do my hair and then go to the convention do my makeup before that as well of course and i'll see you guys in a couple of minutes Ta -da! <laughs> so i am done with my makeup for the day and i'm gonna go to gamescom and i'll check in with you guys there just do a quick fit check I spent the entire day at the Yamaha booth just organizing some of their shows, telling people that they should participate in the giveaway, and helping them with testing out the musical instruments. But in the evening I went to the Diablo 4 party that Blizzard had organized and that was list only as well. So thank you so much for inviting me there, I had lots of fun. I made a coin myself, I fulfilled a challenge, uh, and I was really good at throwing axes in some mysterious way. On day three, it was finally time for the AMD Game Festival and we were in our own hall. So Gamescom had closed up one entire hall and only opened it for this festival. I was in charge of covering the English live broadcast where there was a really, really big German main stage. But still, it was incredibly impressive to see how an event like this actually works on behind the scenes. So let me show you some of that.
then it is finally time for Gamescom to open the hall and I've never seen anything like this before. Okay, okay, I might have slacked on the filming right after this just a little bit because after the show I went out for dinner with friends and I just didn't want to film them out of respect. Now, for the next day I did get ready, but I think I also forgot to film that because I was kind of late. So <laughs> you'll have to take my word for it that I did look uh, like a person when I went to the Yamaha booth again. <laughs> Today is the very last day of Gamescom. And if you couldn't tell, my voice took a little bit of a blow, but most of it is actually not from working, but from talking to other people in the hall. Because when I'm working, I got microphones, right? But when I'm not working, 
everything is very loud and so I yell to get over the noise to have conversations that's a bad idea so unfortunately this is kind of what's been going on but it's only today I'm sure we'll manage to get through it and uh, I am looking a little bit crazy so we'll fix that too in just a second I'm not I don't know if I want this to be my hairstyle today. <laughs> Gonna do my makeup. I'll, I'll check back in with you guys and I'll show you my outfit, which I kind of forgot for the last two days because I always got up kind of not very much on time because <laughs> I was trying to catch up on sleep. And tonight I actually slept a long time, but I didn't sleep very well at like nightmares. That wasn't fun. <laughs> anyway, we'll see how today goes. I'll check back in with you guys. All right, this is my makeup for today. I think it looks cute, and hopefully you think so too. Don't ask me about the hair. I don't know, it wasn't doing what I wanted it to do, but I will give you a fit check, so hang on while I stumble through my hotel room. Ta-da! I think that's okay, yeah? Wearing like a little bodysuit type thing, and a cropped hoodie. Hopefully that works. Alright, I'm gonna go work one more day 